everybody. Welcome to a little session of laughter. Now, I've actually carried out laughter on this page before because that's something I really love to do because it is just a wonderful thing to do and it's free and you can laugh anytime you like. But this particular episode of a Facebook Live, I am doing this with Samantha. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Samantha has beautifully invited me to an event that she has created on the 23rd yeah, of November. Yes, 23rd of November. At Glencore Centre in Weza. That is in what is called Ockendini. So it's down, it's just near Pennycook, it's just, um, just before Pennycook. Um, it's a lovely little um, centre there. Ah, cool. For the Happiness Inside and Out event, which is going to be great. So what that means, Happiness Inside and Out, because Samantha has a Facebook group and she also has a website called the Happiness Hub. I do. I do. Yes. I do have it. <laughs> and it's lots in this place because I mean we all have different ideas of what is happiness. Yeah. Some people think just being able to get out of the bed in the morning is being happy. Some people yeah. just want to be hyper and they think that's being happy. So this little introduction is it is supposed to be all about me telling myself about this workshop, but I think Samantha should tell us as well about what this event is all about. Yes. Yes. So I'll let you go. Go ahead, Samantha. Okay, so this event is to raise awareness as well as funds for the Mental Health um, Research Centre. Um, I am walking the Great Wall of China in March, and this is a fundraiser for it, but it's also a big well-being event because mental health is such a huge thing nowadays. And like our physical um, health, we really need to look after it. And like Lindsay said, happiness is what we all have different versions of what happiness is. So this is a cultivation of all different types of people and therapies that have come together. And so you have a real variety uh, to choose from. And it's going to be um, mini talks for myself. <laughs> and also there will be therapists that you can book in with um, doing holistic therapies from, which maybe if you've seen my page before, Magda, who does um, all different kinds of therapies, which is amazing. She does the Emmet technique, etc. You, if you want to have a look on that, you can have it. Um, there's also reflexologists, Indian head massage. There's so much that you'll be able to do. And then we also have obviously Lindsay, who's going to be doing demos, which she's going to tell you a little bit about, and along with nutritionists. And there should be a whole variety for everybody to get an idea of something for wellness for them, along with our lovely vendors um, who have amazing gifts that are there, that are all different from crystals to health and well-being and nutrition, etc. So we'd love to see you. And it's free. It's a free event and you can book in with the different workshops and talks and to learn a a little bit different about how well-being can be done alternatively rather than maybe taking medication or along with medication because I'm an advocate with you are the expert of you but until you've got the knowledge or the understanding around it you don't have all the choices so this will maybe give you an, an idea of other things that are out there as well so do we get a cup of tea and cake the restaurant or the cafe, it's not a restaurant, the cafe is always open and they oh, do homemade cakes there and they have teas and coffees all day as well in the cafe. Um, and that is run by volunteers, so they love it when you come in to be able to kind of run the, the centre because it's all done through your charity. So um, as well, the centre as well is a, a charity run event, so everything is volunteers, etc. So that would be supporting the locals um, as well as supporting me. <laughs> I've never been to Penny Cook, I have to say. Maybe I've been through it, but I've never actually been to Penny Cook. So it's quite easy to get to, isn't it? It's 
very easy. So if you're coming from Edinburgh, you would head towards um, like straight in and then towards where Ikea is and just keep going straight. And it's all signposted to Pennycook. And oh, just yeah. before you get to Pennycook, there's a little diversion that tells you to go down um, to Ockendini towards the left when you're coming from that way. Because I, I think 90% of people will be coming in from Edinburgh. Mm -hmm. I don't think they'll be coming in from the other way, like from Peebles or anything. But if you're coming through Peebles, you have to go all the way through as if you were going out towards Edinburgh and it's as you're coming out. So Yeah, because um, there could be people there. There could be so it's it's from ten o'clock in the morning till till four in the afternoon or half past ten. Don't get them coming. If we're going at ten, the people are oh, coming right. at half past ten. Don't come I'll, at I'll 10. change at half past ten. <laughs> Mind you, if you come at 10 o'clock, you will not be chased away, let me tell you. No, definitely not. You're just no. not organised. No, no. we'll, we'll, we'll actually, we might end up putting a brush or something in your hand yeah. so you're doing something while you're there. <laughs> yeah, definitely. <laughs> yeah, because that's what we're like, that everybody who's going to be there, uh, Samantha and myself and Magda and Maria and, and everyone else, we really are lovely people. We're very yeah. friendly. Yes. And we're yeah. happy. Happy Very happy. Um, yeah. So I would love to hear what you're going to do, Lindsay. I'm sure everybody else would love to hear as well. But you are going to be offering on that Saturday. What yes, I am a laughter yoga leader, as well as lots of other different things. I have my own business and um, I call myself the Awesome Confidence Coach because I help others to be confident and I one of the ways that I do that is I use laughter and laughter is just fabulous because you don't actually need to be listening to a joke you don't need to be watching anything you don't even need to be laughing you know for a reason but the body knows that you're safe because when you're laughing you are actually safe because that's what, when we are stressed and our bodies tighten up, our eyes are fixed to what's in front of us. And what's happening is that adrenaline is rushing through our body and it's there to help us to either run like mad from whatever it is that it's after us or to, to fight it. And that's what happens when you're, for example, in a traffic jam and you, you, know, you get road rage or you're standing waiting in a queue and there's somebody chat, chat, chattering at the end and you find yourself getting all worked up. And that is our very our survival system of fight or flight. So if you ever find yourself in a position like that, and the more you are aware of it, the easier it becomes to just smile. Just to allow yourself to smile. So let's say we're sitting there, we're, we're you know, we're on the on the, the bypass. Um, I know I've been on the bypass of the Edinburgh bypass. So, oh my goodness me. And you cannot escape it. I've tried. So I'm sitting there, you know, I'm sitting there, I'm in my car. And I could feel myself going, oof, right, okay, I've got to be there at a certain time. Now, if you're sitting there in your car, and in fact, this is something, Samantha, you can do with me. Here we are, we're sitting in our car. Mm -hmm. Okay, we can't steer anymore because we're just not moving. You feel yourself getting really tense. Okay, so what you do is you take a deep breath in. And then as you breathe out, just go. <laughs> a weaver bed. We'll just go, oh, 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 it's a space. Woo! <laughs> oh, 
Oh dear. <laughs> Somebody <laughs> nearly went up to me. <laughs> but that's okay. I'm going quickly now so I can see. <laughs> Joke or something on the on the Netflix or whatever, and go, oh. <laughs> and then that's it. So of course the muscles in our face aren't used to it, you know, because that's what we're made part of what we're made from is our muscles and and our smile. We have to work those muscles. And do you know when you smile as well, there are chemicals in the body that are released. Feel good factor chemicals yeah. and it's well known that if you spend 10 minutes and in the morning is the best time 10 minutes just laughing now you can go around you can put your kettle on you can go <laughs> you can get your tea and go <laughs> keep it going for 10 minutes obviously if you're not used to it start off just start it's all right. I'll just keep talking. You, you, it's actually brilliant. You, I'll just keep talking. It's okay. You know, this is great. Yeah, it's just so yeah. <laughs> you know, the great thing as well is it's infectious. That oh god, yes, it's so infectious. So. Yes, yes. You can't. You cannot be in a room <laughs> with other people who are laughing. You yeah. just can't. It's not. It's not possible. You know, you might find yourself just even just smiling. Um, I was doing a thing on Saturday. I was at an event and I introduced laughing. And I mean, I get so involved in it when I start to laugh. I just go all over the place. I, I, I'm absolutely quite batty. And I had everybody laughing in the room. And later, the, the, the woman who organised it said to me, she says, you know, the highlight of this whole convention was such and such let's call him John I can't remember his name we actually saw John laughing and I looked at her and I said why I said is he not somebody who, who isn't funny she said oh god no he's always constantly complaining but yet he was laughing you, you can't help it you just cannot help it um so I mean this is where I mean this is what we're going to be doing and the crazy thing is as well is that um, I, I should ask you, Samantha, when I'm doing this workshop, where actually is it? I mean, is it one big room? Because I've not been in the centre. So you have a choice. Um, and uh, there is the main hall, so you can ask everybody or you can have it as a smaller, intimate, more court like where they can hold 10 or 20 so that people will sign up for that particular event. So when you arrive, <laughs> it'll be a surprise for you, maybe. <laughs> it'll be like, when you decide that it's an intimate thing or it's for everyone? <laughs> oh, laughter is not intimate. Laughter's got to be shared. It really has. So, so we'll be in the big hall. We'll yeah, be in the big hall. Yeah, the big main hall that you can do it in and then invite everybody in for that half an hour. I mean, last time when... Uh, in the summer when we had it, we had a choir there and everybody loved it. Like, even though like there's therapies and different things going on, um, but they just absolutely loved being mm -hmm. part of it. Um, along with the, I'll say it again, these vendors <laughs> from America. <laughs> they loved it like a lot of the time it's, it's you, they don't get to see or interact with it. So they did like that. So yeah, you've got a choice to do it in there or you have a choice to have it in the little room where it is more intimate. Good. Will there be any other workshops going on when I'm doing my after yoga? 
Uh, at the moment, no, there's not. There's only years that's on. I've only scheduled in your, like, everybody's kind of just doing it um, 20 minutes, right. an hour. Um, and I haven't scheduled anybody else to do that just to give the best opportunity for the person to be able to, to involve it because there's therapies there as well. So there may be somebody who's getting an Indian head massage at the same time as you, but I just didn't want to overwhelm them with, oh, well, we've got a choice of four different workshops or whatever. Mm. So mm. The way that I've staggered it is that um, it starts off with an introduction with myself to tell you about the day. If you arrive at 10.30, that is what it is. Then we have the lovely Anne Cross at 11, who is going to be giving a talk, which will be in the cafe section of it. And then at uh, 12 o'clock, um, is it 12? Half 11? Half 11, we have the demonstration um, from Maria. Um, oh, right, yeah. Reference. And then at 12 o'clock, we have Grace Under Fire, um, and it's her story. Um, it's kind of like a little workshop as well with Anna Lovelock. And then at 12.30, we have a bit of a break. We have, um, yeah, we don't have anybody in at 12.30. We have then at 1 o'clock, me, myself, the happy minds, giving you the habits of happiness. Then yourself at 1.30, and then at... Um, 2 30 we have an introduction to crystals and i think at two o'clock that we've not put in because she's just decided to do it is lovely Sandra with um the heroes and um, i was going to say help the heroes but it's not helping you know the be your own heroes <laughs> oh be yeah. your own heroes workshop demonstration she's going to do a little talk on on that because she'll be running them in uh, i think in the new year in midlothian so she was going to be doing a little demo okay. on that. Yeah, so that's right. kind of how it's running. So that's kind of staggered and people can pick where they want to go and they kind of know when it is. So there is a booklet that I will put in um, and it will get updated um, with Sandra's details as well because she's just decided to join us, which is amazing, which is lovely. Yeah, yeah. Good, yeah. No, I asked as well because laughter is quite loud. Yeah. And you don't want a, a little quiet. So we'll, uh, we will tell the people <laughs> a quiet massage to maybe like. <laughs> mind you, mind you. That... Quiet massage. <laughs> <laughs> well, what we could just do for my 20 minutes, my half an hour is silent laughter. No, we like a good laugh. I mean, if we have dancers and then they are... You know, I think that's funny. Oh, excellent. Great. I tell the ladies who are therapists anyway that to maybe give like maybe foot massages at that time. <laughs> <laughs> Rather than a silent. No, they're, they're not going to be silent anyway because they're all kind of in the room. So the treatments are going to be interactive as well and it's quite nice. So, um, mm. yeah, because the, everything works in together and holistically that they're all connected you know like when you're doing laughter as well as the, you're getting a physical treatment it'll enhance it because you're having joy and so when you're having joy and you're having even an Indian head massage or reflexology or even a like a back neck and shoulder massage or a hand massage it'll increase it even more because your oxytocin levels will be like way yeah, absolutely yeah and the energy as and well energy. You know, because when, when you laugh, the energy that comes from us, yeah. the actual vibrations, the frequencies that we emit, then they, they go into, like, everybody. So, yeah, and yes. everyone's going to be going out just laughing. Like that. <laughs> be high, be like, this is the best treatment I've ever had. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it can, oh, absolutely. I mean, laughter can make you give you that high feeling it creates energy oh yeah the endorphins and dopamine that gets released when you're laughing and then on top of that and getting a hand massage or a foot massage you're just in oh. bliss <laughs> <laughs> could anybody not come to the event i think i think you would be off your rocker if you didn't come to this free event free <laughs> free you don't even have to pay it's free <laughs> And yeah, there's a bonus that not only do you have us to 
there. <laughs> Which, if anybody's watching this, you can see we're actually quite batty. When we get together, we really. <laughs> We should actually be let out together no. out into the, the wide world. I know. I think we just stay in Zoom. <laughs> and we're like, too much, both of you at the same time. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> oh, wonderful, Samantha. Thank you so much. Thank you. And thank you for being part of my day. I really appreciate it. Oh, well, I, any. Tell you what, any opportunity where I can get out there, not only just laugh, but get up on the stage and have people, people laughing with me. Yeah. Oh, love it. Love Finding it. your light. <laughs> <Yay>. <laughs> oh, so anybody who's watching here, I've put the links in for everything that we've talked about. Any questions you want to know, please ask us. Um, I'll put Samantha's uh, Facebook page, Facebook name on as well, so that you can contact Samantha if you want to, or myself. And if you want to, you know, I mean, come along and laugh as well as everything else. And I guarantee, I would actually say you can get your money back, but it's free to come. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful, absolutely wonderful. You are. Oh, so have you got any last words, Samantha? <laughs> no, Bill, do I always have last words? Yes, I always yes. have. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> thanks again. And as Lindsay said, the links will be below. Uh, they'll be on my Facebook page too, and I'll put them into as many links as possible. Um, it would be great if you got a ticket just to give us an idea of how many people are coming mm -hmm. and also you get a little it's kind of like a goodie bag where there'll be offers etc so if we know that you're coming we can kind of prepare it beforehand as well for you wonderful yeah. all, all right i think only a couple of weeks away so yeah i yeah. know i know and these are they're just flying by so yes absolutely yeah. so anybody's watching i'm gonna love you and leave you and as I say, any questions, put them in the comments box or Samantha or myself. But otherwise, have a wonderful day. Let's finish off with laughing, shall we? Yes. <laughs> <laughs>